Welcome to Akriti Designs, shape your dreams. Please subscribe to our channel and enable the bell icon for notification. Don't forget to like and share. This video explain the complete procedure of slump flow test and slump cone test. 1. Slump flow test on self-compacting concrete for workability. The slump flow test is a method to determine consistency of fresh concrete, it is used primarily for assessing the self-compacting concrete that is too fluid or workable to be measured using the slump test, because the concrete will not retain its shape when the cone is removed. The slump flow test is used to assess the horizontal free flow of self-compacting concrete in the absence of obstructions. It was first developed in Japan for use in assessment of underwater concrete. It is the most commonly used test, and gives a good assessment of filling ability. The allowable temperature of concrete is 10 to 32 degrees Celsius. Checking the temperature of concrete. This concrete have the ability to pass between reinforcement without any block, but may give some indication of resistance to segregation. The test can be profitably be used to assess the consistency of supply of ready mixed concrete to a site from load to load. The slump flow value required is 700 plus or minus 75 mm. That means 625 to 775 mm. The slump flow value at site is 740 mm. Second test. Checking the temperature of concrete. The slump flow value at site is 720 mm. Slump Cone Test Slump Cone Test for checking the workability of concrete. Concrete Slump Test or Slump Cone Test is to determine the workability or consistency of concrete mix prepared at the laboratory or the construction site during the progress of the work. Concrete Slump Test is carried out from batch to batch to check the uniform quality of concrete during construction. The slump test is the most simple workability test for concrete, involves low cost and provides immediate results. Due to this fact, it has been widely used for workability tests since 1922. Generally concrete slump value is used to find the workability, which indicates water cement ratio, but there are various factors including properties of materials, mixing methods, dosage, admixtures etc. also affect the concrete slump value. Required slump value for slump cone test is 220 plus or minus 40. That means 180 millimeters to 260 millimeters. Slump value at site is 250 millimeters.
checking the temperature of concrete. Slump value at site is 250 millimeters. Please subscribe to our channel for more videos. Don't forget to like and share. Thanks for watching.